Good morning, everyone. It is week four of WWW. I trust that you have been inspired by the episodes that have been aired before, and more importantly, that you have grasped something from the Word of God, which is shared after each episode. Last week, we learned about homophones, and here's just a quick reminder of what a homophone is. It is used to describe each of two or more words having the same pronunciation, but different meanings, origins, or spelling. Today, our focus is the word for, or I should say, the words for and for. The first four, spelled F-O-U-R, refers to a number that is one more than three. The second four, spelled F-O-R-E, is used for in, toward, or near the front, or for something that occupies a front position. It can be used as one, an adverb, as in in, toward, or near the front, or to explain something that occurred at an earlier time or period. Two, an adjective, situated in front of something else or prior in order of occurrence. Three, a preposition. Four, an interjection. Five, or as a combining form. For instance, four leg, four arm, for warn, for seen, for no, for ordain, and so forth. Let us now make some biblical applications to the two words. For, F-O-U-R. And after these things, I saw four angels standing on the four corners of the earth, holding the four winds of the earth, that the wind should not blow on the earth, nor on the sea, nor on any tree. And he shall send his angels with a great song of a trumpet, and they shall gather together his elect from the four winds, from one end of heaven to the other. Daniel spake and said, I saw in a vision by night, and behold, the four winds of the heaven strove upon the great sea, F-O-R-E, for whom he did foreknow. He did also predestine to be conformed to the image of his son that he might be the firstborn among many brethren. But with the precious blood of Christ, as of a lamb without blemish and without spot, who verily was foreordained before the foundation of the world, but was manifest in these last times for you, who by him do believe in God, that raised him up from the dead and gave him glory, that your faith and hope might be in God. Four is not going to be the final episode of WWW. You are hereby humbly forewarned. So, see you next week, same time, same place, same motive, offering you a word to the wise.